and you put me. All right. I'm all right. But God said, in the face of what 22 will bring, He didn't leave us without a what? Vision. Yes, God. What we need now is a vision. Yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, God. Yes, sir. Can't think of what we need now is a vision. Amen. Yes, sir. Uh, so, so, what's happening now? All your skillful, crafted preachers that know how to put together a sermon, Come on. they can help you. Come on. That sit up all Saturday night and put together a sermon. Come on. Ain't no God that got a bunch of commentaries and they put and they got skillful putting stuff together, but they ain't no vision. Right. And what there's no vision, the people do what? Perish. Right. Oh, they saying it now. Ain't nobody saying it to me now. So lift your hand and say thank you, Jesus. Mm -hmm. What there is no vision. We need preachers with a vision that can see now. We need preachers who get in the spirit realm for God's people and can see something. Because if the blind need the blind, all y'all going into the ditch. How you gonna get here and call yourself a leader and you didn't see it coming? Y'all ain't gonna help me back. I wish I had some happen here tonight. So I shout the devil is a liar. Give me some eyes. Make me a visionary. See. But we don't spend no time in prayer to do what? To see. Sit down and think about all of these saints that are not upon the visionaries. Sermon makers. Folk that know how to do church. Got big names. Big cathedrals. Know how to do that religious system thing. Yeah. My God. But it didn't help coming in 2020. Right. No, all the sir. big time preachers had all the prophets in. Yes, and sir. nobody saw COVID coming. And nobody right. saw it. Right. And then get on YouTube breaking down crying. Because you allowed the prophets to come in to prophesy and rape the people. But they ain't see COVID coming. Yeah. My God. The prophet job is to see what's coming. Amen. Right. Come on. Yes, yes God. Yes. You're preaching. I said to see what's coming. Yes. Amen. How we gonna see God? Yes, amen. Nobody see anything coming. My God. And so God said to me, we satisfied sitting under the blind. My God. Come on. We satisfied sitting on the blind. And another Sunday shouting, another Sunday dancing, another Sunday having all the good time, but folk dying on our watch. And ain't nobody seen nothing. My God, my God. I knew we were gonna get tight somewhere down through, and that's why I called in the beginning. You're preaching! Preach! God said, "What well, there is no vision. That's right. Good people don't perish. Yes. My God. Yes, sir. That's yes. the Bible. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So the question becomes, what are you preaching? My, My God. That. Come on. It's a division. Come on. It's going to keep the people from perishing. Come on. God said, if I sin it, they ain't going to perish. They ain't going down. If, I, if it come out of me, they ain't going down. And, and watch that. And in many cases, all we got to do is hear it. That's right. Touch it. Have the effect of it. How many going to see it tonight? So, glory Bible is going to be spared from a whole lot of pain because you're touching that spirit. And not only that, there's a pain God will confirm. And when it's confirmed by the mouth of proof and wisdom, that every word will be shattered until we will be all right. I thought, God, God, should I do that? God, should I do that? Should I do that? And so the Lord said to me, man of God, and this is going to help those of you in prophetic apostolic ministry. He said, tell them you got to seek to become. Men of the spirit realm yeah, yeah, yeah. that live in the spirit realm, yes. but we don't pray enough for that. Come on, you preach. We got all kind of excuses why we can't spend hours around the altar. Come on, yeah. why we can't see nothing. We can't see it coming. Come on. He said, "Watch and pray." Yeah, yeah. Come on, man. Stop the devil got from the saints. Hebrews six says, "You ought to watch and persevere and pray." That's yes. right. Watch and watch and see what that devil doing. Come on, say amen. 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 The leaders are blind. My yep. God. No vision for their own people. Yep. My God. Amen. Amen. Attacks, hits, conspiracies, demonic mysteries. And they can't see. My God. But here comes Judas upon Jesus. 
Come on. But Jesus is like, boy, don't worry about it. I know who he is. That's Ooh. right. Yeah. He's a devil in disguise. I already know. That's right. They right. ain't got nothing. He's like, pray too much for you to have. That's right. But they ain't got nothing. They ain't saying that. That's right. Say, hallelujah. 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 Yeah. They become me and we there's a life in the spirit realm. Somebody said life in the spirit realm. Where do you stay in the spirit realm? Where do you live in the spirit world? Y'all think I'm going to have me crazy with you? Come on, say that. Ain't no way in the world you could be here in Tampa and you can live in the spirit realm. That's the mission in the spirit world that you rule, that you reign. That's why we came and gave you the staff and gave you the shepherd to rule. So when they hear a voice of demons from the children, because they know that there's an abode inside the spirit realm where the prophets live. I wish I had something. And we have learned how to live there and learn how to say there are no weapon from the dish you would be able to prosper. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. all filled up in through why the devil ain't shut him down. Oh, my God. Right, right, right. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. There's a heavenly place. And we see it in. Woo. In Christ Jesus. Rob of all principality. Rob of all power. Tell him, I wish you knew yourself like that devil knew you. Lord, help me, Jesus. That's why my God, they were down at Ephesus. The devil say, Paul, I know. Jesus, I know. Why? Because Paul was a man of the spirit. He said, I was coming up to the third heaven. But then the body out of body, I don't know. Such a man was coming up. Lord, help me, preacher. And Paul knew, could no devil deal with that man. Have you discovered that man? Or are you right here just preaching and prophesying and don't even know who he is in the realm of the spirit? But if you knew you like the devil knew you, like the witches knew you, and so God said, tell you tonight, your attacks is a telltale sign of who you is in the spirit. And if you get hit like that, that means you somebody in the realm of the spirit. Ain't no time to fall up, ain't no time to cry, ain't no time to give up, ain't no time to put your tail between your legs. You only find out by hell who you really are. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He's trying to pull you out your place in the spirit world. Yeah. Let me go see. Yeah. That's why the apostle Paul, because he lived in that place in Revelation. If they got from God and by revelation, they get it from this religion. They get it from Gamaliel and all that. He got it straight from Jesus by the red revelation. And he lived in that. He lived so close to him. Got a snake bit him and he shook it in the fire. He shook it in the fire. How can he do that? Because he lived in the realm of the spirit. Son said, I was caught up in the spirit of the honesty. Y'all they will help me praise it. And I saw him sitting up on the throne. Hallelujah, glory to God. And he told me to come up here now. My God, draw the room, bitches. This is from the spirit of him. God speaking direct. God speaking express. I ain't going to see it show you what's coming to pass tomorrow. What's coming to pass a year from now. What's coming to pass. I ain't going to see it. Because that's why I'm looking for some Jones. I'm looking for some Jones. I'm looking for some apostles that can live in the spirit. Watch what God said. Watch what God said for a second. Yes, sir. Glory, If it came out of him and it came in the earth, because if he didn't want to preserve his people, it never came out of him. Yes, sir. Amen. So since it came out, the light came where out of him, Amen. and it's shining to an individual, yes, and it's shining out to the people, yes, the people going to be yes, all right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Because that same sovereign that spoke it yes, is the same sovereign hand that's going to be ruling over you. Hallelujah. Glory be to God in here. I tell you, I feel like preaching on it. If I ain't never preaching before, I'm preaching on it. I need some folk that know they God tonight. Can you say yes? I said, can you say yes? Sure, I want to be caught up in the spirit. Thank you, Jesus. Somebody gonna get a shot tonight. Somebody gonna get a shot 